हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू मल्टी वन ई कॉमर्स सीरीज इन लारवल ट्वेल्व आई एम अमित गुप्ता योर गाइड फॉर दिस सीरीज थ्रू आउट दिस टूटोरियल आई विल वॉक यू थ्रू बिल्डिंग ए कंप्लीट मल्टी वन ई कॉमर्स वेबसाइट यूजिंग लारवल ट्वेल्व सो वेदर यू आर ए बिगनर और एन एक्सपीरियंस डेवलपर दिस सीरीज विल हेल्प यू अंडरस्टैंड लारवल लेटेस्ट फीचर्स एंड हाउ टू इम्प्लीमेंट दैम अफेक्टिवली सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट सो इन दिस series uh, we are going to build a fully functional multi vendor e-commerce website from scratch using the latest laravel 12 framework why laravel 12 so this is the question that many of the users may ask that why we want to use laravel 12 for this multi vendor e-commerce series so laravel is one of the most powerful and widely used php framework for web development so one of the reason is this one. with the recent release of laravel 12 we will explore and implement its latest features so we want to explore the latest features of laravel 12 and this is the best platform to integrate those features and laravel 12 is great for building e-commerce websites because it offers improved security better api support and enhanced database queries for faster performance so this is the reason that we want to use laravel 12 for this multi vendor e-commerce series so basically what is multi vendor e-commerce website if anyone does not know uh, that what is multi vendor e-commerce then the first thing that we must clear that uh, what is multi vendor e-commerce exactly okay so multi vendor e-commerce platform allows multiple seller to register and sell their products on a single website similar to amazon or ebay this model supports both b2b and b2c transactions while enabling the site owner to manage vendors orders and payment efficiently so see here this is the single vendor and this is the multiple vendor multi vendor we can say <clears throat> so in the single vendor there is only one owner of the website that is the simple basic website basic e-commerce website in which there is only one vendor means there is only one seller there is only one owner of that website like a small store we can say okay so in that the seller is going to add the products in his website and the users will come users will register and uh, purchase those products so that is simple case and that is in which the single vendor exists but in multi vendor there are multiple vendors in the website so the multiple vendors will add their products in the website and those products uh, the users are going to buy in the multi vendor e-commerce website vendors are going to register as well like users this is the major difference between single vendor and multi vendor i hope that it's clear to you and there are more differences like i have explained a number of sellers there is only one seller in single vendor but there are multiple sellers in multi vendor as far as the business model is concerned the owner sells their own products but in multi vendor platform allows vendors to sell products as far as the revenue model is concerned in multi vendor e-commerce vendor is going to pay some fees to the admin uh for using its services so that he can able to sell the products on the multi vendor e-commerce website but in single vendor it's not the case and as far as the products are concerned uh products are limited to owners inventory uh, but in multi vendor wide range of products from different vendors as far as the order management is concerned store owners handles all orders but in multi vendor vendor manage their own orders and inventory every vendor will have its own panel in which he is going to manage his own orders okay uh, so uh, that is the case in multi vendor and the examples of uh, single vendor is nike and apple.com and the example of multi vendor e-commerce is like amazon and ebay so we are going to build the website like amazon okay so these are the key features of the multi vendor marketplace first one is the vendor registration vendors can register for free or via paid subscription so in multi vendor vendors are going to register but in single vendor vendor does not register at all okay there is only one vendor and that is just constant product management vendor can list edit and manage their products so every vendor will have the full control of their panel in which they are going to add their own products they can update their products okay commission system admin can charge like i have explained earlier admin can charge a commission on each sale see there are 
different ways like admin can charge a small fees uh, for every order or admin can charge the fees on monthly basis so so there are the different ways and we are going to explore and we'll implement one of the ways in in this multi vendor e-commerce website order and payment processing payments are routed through the platform before reaching vendors so see vendor uh, will not receive the complete payment of the order like if the admin is going to charge uh, some amount like one percent of the order or two percent of the order then first admin is going to receive his amount and after that rest of the amount will be transferred to the vendor so this system we are going to build in this multi-vendor e-commerce website shipping and delivery management either vendor or admins can handle shipping customer support and dispute resolution admin or vendors can manage faulty product complaints okay so now we will talk about the admin features what admin is going to do in this multi vendor e-commerce website monitor and manage vendor activities admin is going to manage the activities of the vendor admin is concerned with the activities of the vendor like if any vendor uh, will add wrong product will do some kind of spamming then the uh, admin may disprove vendor products once the vendor adds the products First, admin is going to approve those products. Only then those products will be visible on the website. And same thing happen with the categories as well. Vendor can able to request the categories to the admin and admin can able to approve those requests and will add those categories in the multi-vendor e-commerce website. Track vendor transactions and commission. Admin are going to track vendor transaction and commission that everything is working smoothly. All payment system is working smoothly or not. Okay and admin is going to manage customer orders and disputes okay so admin can also manage the customer orders and disputes in some cases uh, but a vendor can also able to do those things vendor features so roles of vendor dedicated seller dashboard see every vendor will have its own dashboard will have its own panel in which he is going to manage everything track earnings and transactions so every vendor is going to track his own earnings that how much he earns so far so complete reporting system uh, we are going to build for every vendor he can uh, check out his own transactions manage coupons and discounts so we are going to provide this feature to every vendor they can able to add the coupon and they can able uh, to give the offers uh, to the users so the complete uh, coupon and discount feature we are going to give to every vendor see in vendor panel uh, once the vendor is going to add the products he can able to add the uh, add the coupons for those products as well okay request new product categories so vendor can able to request the new product categories and that uh, the admin can approve integrate social media accounts so every vendor can integrate his social media accounts so these are the features of the multi vendor e-commerce website i hope that all these features are clear to you and on the basis of these features we are going to start the multi vendor e-commerce website practically from next video and i hope that you will subscribe the channel for that in the next episode we will install laravel 12 and set up authentication to kick start our multi-vendor e-commerce website development so please stay tuned for that and don't forget to subscribe the channel okay so please subscribe the channel channel is youtube.com stack developers please subscribe the channel for all laravel updates and for this multi-vendor e-commerce website thank you so much have a nice time goodbye